Hey, what is going on the YouTube? This is Robert, and today I am bringing you to this week's drop because obviously uh, I'm not going to be going for anything. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I haven't really seen many retails. I mean, the only retails that I've realistically seen are for like the skull, and then that's about it. Uh, basically, I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to act like I've looked through everything because I haven't. So we're just going to be jumping straight into this, seeing what the retails are when I go onto the website, and then seeing how things go. And yeah, I saw a couple of people say on Discord like. Where's the video from, like me, for instance, to go over the drops, see the sizing and everything? Uh, because obviously, I don't think uh, a lot of people know still that Supreme updated our time to four o'clock. So, yeah, it's just one of those things. But now you know, at least if you didn't before. But yeah, as per normal, though, good luck to those who are going for the drop on Saturday in Japan and Korea. I hope you can get what you're after. But yeah, let's just jump straight into this. Okay, so it's drop time, obviously. Uh, and everything is in so let's go ahead and take a look and just open the items that will probably uh, end up going in the end I don't know about the beanies so much I'm not gonna lie uh, but in relation to the other items I just want to take a look at their retails and see what they're sitting at so 44 pounds it will probably end up selling out uh, will it be an expensive collectible in the end I don't know about that like based off of like the anatomy model in the past you know maybe uh, because it is something seemingly that you can take apart and build because it's a model slash puzzle so seemingly it's something like that but I don't know I feel like the anatomy model uh, seems smaller than this so it might be easier to like have out and things like that especially since it's in a box so even if you don't want to build it and have it out you can just sit it out whereas this I don't know how it's going to come uh, I've got no clue so the gloves were 128 and they have four different sizes okay Ooh. 1200 saying that the stone colorway is basically out of stock wow I mean yeah it was one of the colorways I thought was okay but still I didn't think it would fly as far as the nups is concerned uh, none of them are moving so we can close that and it's still uh, quite a price point in the reversible piece nothing and the sideline piece black colorway yeah, and the grey. So at least, yeah, again, like two colourways that I was kind of anticipating. Even the orange might go as well, which I would not have anticipated. But yeah, at least some things are going uh, that we can sort of expect in the end. But other than that, we're just going to have to wait and... S really? I didn't see that coming. Like, every colourway gone. Like, yeah, I would say in this, in like the, the ivory tone... I would have expected it to go, but not not as fast as it has done, because that was just about two minutes, and it was gone. Oh, I didn't know there was Supreme on the back of it. Oh, you can barely see that in, like, some of the colorways, no wonder. So that might be towards the point of why it's so sought after in the end. Because looking at the photos yesterday, I was just looking at the front uh, photos. I didn't go into detail looking at it. But that's definitely the reason as to why it's gone. Yeah, an embroidered logo on the chest what wall blend with embroidered logo on chest and applique logo on back i like what what am i like where i i believe the obviously the on the back bit i can see that but on chest there is there is nothing anyway let's not get caught up on that let's keep going down uh the drop obviously to see if anything else has gone but that's I'm surprised that's actually gone, like, that quickly in the end. Those two colorways have gone. Obviously, orange is going to go soon. Other than that, uh, it seems like it's... I wouldn't say the more unique pieces of this week, but i definitely say that it is... Skull is also sold out. There you go. Uh, I would say that it's pretty in line or on par with what would have been anticipated or what I was kind of expecting, to be honest. Um, I'd still kind of hope for either the stone or the blue to completely sell out in this uh, that's just me personally but yeah these two colorways they looked fine and they, they're the better ones of the three uh, in this I was more so expecting like the ivory and the pink not every single colorway but you know it's better in the end that every single one's gone realistically that's that's cool to see uh, obviously to do with the back graphic as well there is definitely no front embroidery 
no, no, I don't believe that. Uh, and other than that, there isn't really anything else that I'm kind of like holding out hope for, almost, uh, because obviously the skull's gone, so that's like a to be expected. I wouldn't really say beanie or something like yet. I'd say maybe in an hour or so we might see a couple of them gone, but that's just me sort of grasping straws at that point. Uh, realistically, I don't really know what else from this week would be sought after, but. Yeah, let's just go through the tabs, uh, the sections, and then end up on sizing. So obviously under the jackets tab, we've got the parka, the nuts, and the uh, reversible alongside the other jacket, the puffer jacket. Two colorways obviously gone in the puffer jacket. Uh, orange will probably go, but yeah, these two were just the best ones. Nothing in the reversible, nothing in the nuts, or in the uh, fill down parka either. We've moved straight onto the shirts tab for the tartan flannel. Uh, yeah, none of them have gone any sizes. So nearly black colorway, yeah. So if the black and red go as well in that, then it might be more to like my expectations uh, for colorways that would do well, but will not do well, but sort of sell out in the end. Uh, for the top slash sweaters tab, we've obviously got the applique cable knit, which is completely sold out. I don't really know which colorway went first. Hopefully my expectation would have been either the ivory, yeah, or the pink. Uh, but in reality, it probably could have been the ivory and the navy, and then pink and black being the other two. But yeah, i definitely say that it should just be this one first. But with the back sort of graphic going on, it might also be the navy uh, because of that. But yeah, anyway, we can go on to the sweatshirts tab where we've just got the leaf piece. I also forgot for the top slash sweaters, we obviously do have the short sleeve top and the thermal long sleeve polo as well. But yeah, uh, let's just go straight over to the pants tab where we've got the leaf pant followed by the mountain pant and yeah, none of them have gone. So we can go straight onto the hats tab where we've got the championship box logo new era which is just sitting alongside the velvet paisley uh, like camp cap which is the same and the Polatec piece which is the exact same. So we can go all the way down onto the boonie which is the same. From there, we can just hit the beanies, which are, yeah, the same. So from there, we've got the bags where, yeah, nothing's gone. So go straight on to accessories where we've got the gloves and the keychain and obviously the human skull. And just the skull is the one to have sold out. So let's just go on to sizing. Obviously, I go through this three by three. So if you'd like to, you can just pause at any point in time. And yeah, let us go through. So expectations for this drop and things that actually went on. Uh, I wasn't really expecting the sweaters to go as fast as they did, but then again, if I'd actually looked and seen it, they had the big back graphic saying Supreme and everything, it probably would have made sense, but, you know, that's just one of those things. Aside from that, I mean, it's all sort of just within expectation of if pieces look nice, if colorways are nice enough in the end, then they should sell out, and that's kind of what's gone on in the end. Just the pieces that have decent colorways have gone, and that's that, like... Yeah, there's nothing really else that you can hope for uh, with a drop like this. You just want the pieces that just look decent to go, and it's happened. So let's just look down the week and just see if anything else has gone. Kind of expecting this to go. Don't know when, but hopefully it will do. Uh, I don't know about blue or black. Maybe all three will end up going, but none of the nupses will go. That's a definite. Uh, other than that, the orange should go. This black and red should probably go within about an hour. Black faster than the red. Uh, besides that, they're obviously gone. Uh, I don't really expect any of these. And yeah, just possibly a beanie or two. And that's about it, I'd say, for this week. So yeah, as per norm, let me know down below what you picked up. Whether you took a W, whether you took an L. Whether you went for one of the pieces that were sort of non-North Face related in the end. Because I feel like those were the actual hyped pieces in the end. Like, North Face brings its own level of hype. But I think the actual lookbook pieces that were sought after brought their own like attention or individual attention because that's just how they look. And personally, yeah, I feel that they are the better pieces. These two colorways, I feel that this piece is definitely up there. Aside from that, I wouldn't really say a ton, uh, except for obviously the skull brought its own attention to itself. So yeah, so that's going to cover it for me. Good luck to those who are going for the drop on Sase in Japan and Korea or those going for Palace tomorrow. And yeah, that is all I can say. Yeah, I've got nothing else. So yeah, thank you for watching. I do hope that you have a good rest of your day. And I will see you all next time. Peace.